Before we start off this video, I do want to say rest in peace to Jason, Dave, and Frank, who did play Tommy Oliver, the original Green and White Rangers, and a bunch of other Rangers. A childhood hero to many. Um, yeah, it's it's tragic. Uh, he took his own life very recently, and it's uh, hard for me to believe still. It's been quite some time now, and it's still hard for me to believe. And yeah, condolences to his family, his children. Take care of yourselves out there, everyone. If, if you're watching this video, please take care of yourselves and take care of the people around you. All right, so we're on Premium Bandai. <laughs> and uh, we got already, we got our second ever uh, Common Rider Geats uh, Premium Bandai item. And it's the Jamato Buckle. Now, a lot of people were actually expecting this to be the first uh, Premium Bandai thing for Common Rider Geats. But hey, look at that. It's number two. And our second one ever second one of this month so november is already a, a month for a lot of premium bad eye stuff for geats so there we go we got the jamato buckle it's just this part here i only see pictures of it on this side of the belt i don't know if that's like if you what you just can't use it on this side i don't i'm not too sure i'm not cut up on geats so i don't know uh i need to do that but uh, yeah, all the pictures here are going to show it's on this side. So we got the entry form. So it does come with this core ID thing. I Something. <laughs> but we got the buckle here. And it does play some music or some sounds. So that's fun. Okay, so it's kind of like along the lines of like the beat raise buckle. You know how the beat raise buckle does sounds by itself. So... Kind of like that. Very, very cool. Ooh, I like the purple lights. That's fun. And of course, you can use it with the boost raise buckle because boost just works with everything. But here we go. We got close ups of the item. Looks very, very interesting. Looks very, very evil. You know, definitely meant for a villain. Look at that. It's just broken. Um, this is 4,290 yen uh start accepting reservations now and reservation acceptance closing date is december 20th so about a month to get this straight from premium bandai if you are here in japan if, if you're not um you'll have to go through a middleman and it, it will be more expensive as usual and it is scheduled to be shipped in march of 2023 so there we go. We got our second premium Bandai item uh, in Geats. And we'll see how many more premium Bandai items Geats has throughout its run. Um, yeah, very interested to seeing how many there are compared to Revice especially. Um, so by the end of Geats, we'll definitely have to like kind of round it up and compare it to Revice. Uh, that, that'll have to be a video eventually. So... Uh, yeah, that's that. But, personally, and I think a lot of other people will agree with me, um, but something a little more exciting, yet, yet disappointing. <laughs> we got campaign information for the Common Rider Tycoon Core ID. Yes, it is a campaign item. The it was supposed to be a Christmas campaign. Uh, I mean, that's what leaks said apparently, but uh, it, that did not happen. Or maybe it wasn't even meant to be a Christmas campaign. Maybe it's because because I mean it's it's fairly close to Christmas, right? The third of December. So I don't know. Maybe someone got mixed up or something. But anyways, yes. So let's read this from December third, two thousand twenty-two, Saturday. Purchase either the Transformation Belt DX Desire Driver or the DX Command Twin Buckle and Raging Sword set and start a campaign to receive the Common Rider Tycoon Core ID on a first come, 
first served basis oh my gosh so you're gonna have to buy a toy to get this so let's take a look at the toy before we jump into that actually i i should have done that first shouldn't i uh come on let's load here here we go and this was leaked already this had been leaked. All right, so here we go. We got the DX Twin Buckle and Raging Sword set. So, uh, yeah. <laughs> wow. Um, there's There were more pictures. I saw more pictures, but they're not on the official Bandai site for some reason. All right, that makes sense. Um, yeah, but uh, it's basically... It's not a new belt. It's just twin buckles, as it says here. Twin buckles. So it's two buckles... And you put him on your desired driver. Yeah, and then we got this raging sword. So I get I guess this is is this Geats' power up? Like another power up for him, maybe? I guess. I don't know. I I don't know. I have no idea. But um yeah, it's released on December 3rd, as you know, that, that makes sense, right? That's when the campaign starts. Its price is 6490 yen. So, yeah, you get both things, I guess, in this set. I guess, can you not buy them separately? I guess you have to buy them together. That's kind of strange. From Toku Tokuan on Twitter. Um, Yeah, it's uh, here you got the, a better look at the sword. Well, not a better look, but like a different look at the sword. And then, yeah, the two buckles right here. Um, yeah, they look cool. I like the the symmetry of a of you know of the look here um so that yeah yeah it looks really good on the belt so that's awesome um i don't know it looks like can you put i can't tell from this angle but can you put a raise buckle here it looks like you could put something there but i'm not too sure uh, a power-up item for Geats and Tycoon. Oh, okay. Well, then there you go. You got a. It's a power-up item for Geats and Tycoon. Cool. Good to know. <laughs> uh, but yeah. So there you go. And let's go back to our campaign item that uh, you know everyone's looking forward to. <laughs> so here we go. Yeah. Um. We got Geats and Tycoon. We got the Tycoon Core ID. Um. I mean, <laughs> I I don't know. I don't understand why they had to make Tycoon a campaign item. Like, Tycoon's a main rider. Like, he's the secondary rider. It's just so weird to make him have a campaign. Like, I don't know. It doesn't make any sense. Like, I mean, I guess he, like... Like, you could argue that he's special to the story. Like, he's, like, the main character of Geats. Like, even though he's not, like, the flagship character, he's, like, more of, like, the main character. He's the one with the story and everything. But that that should make him have just a regular release. Like, <laughs> you know, you don't see, like, Oni Sister get, like, you know, weird releases or anything. So, I don't know. This is strange. It's 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 strange i don't know why they chose to do that like you'd think like i don't know maybe even like punk jack like i can see punk jack getting this kind of treatment anyways that's how you get it so good luck to everyone <laughs> overseas who wants this because yeah i that that sucks <laughs> i'm i'm gonna i'm gonna try my best to get it. i'm gonna try to like you know go to the store early and everything and try to pick this up um get this command twin buckle and raising oh is it the raising sword not raging it's raising sword not raging sword it's raising sword okay google translate sometimes you know um yeah honestly um i i probably wouldn't get this necessarily but the fact that you have to buy one of these two things and, you know, of obviously a lot of people already have the desire driver. Like that's, <laughs> I have the desire driver, obviously. So it's like, yeah, like how many people are going to get a desire driver, you know, but most people are probably going to end up buying this, you know, so, uh, but yeah, I, pro I probably honestly wouldn't get this if the, if the Tycoon Core ID wasn't you know, a campaign item. So anyway, then there's a commercial for it too here. I'm not going to play it because I don't want to get eaten off of YouTube, but 
Uh, yeah, that that's that's it. That's all. That's it there. I'm going to leave it right there for you to admire. Thank you all so much, everyone, for watching. Please subscribe if you haven't. Follow us on our social media down below. We have a Discord, and we will see you all next time.